Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to today's webinar, which is brought to you by Better Size Instruments. Why focus on particle analysis? To achieve top quality, it is essential to use raw materials with optimal physical and mechanical properties. Particle size, shape, and distribution influence everything from flowability to sintering and efficiencies, ultimately affecting the precision, mechanical properties, and surface finish of the final product. Adip Manufacturing uses a wide range of materials, including polymers, metals, composites, ceramics, and biomaterials. In practice, particles of different sizes produce a combined diffraction pattern or spectrum, allowing comprehensive particle size distribution analysis. This makes laser diffraction an essential tool across diverse applications. The better size of 2600 include our patented optics, wide measurement range, rapid testing with high accuracy, and modular design suitable for water-based, solvent-based, and even dry samples. With the combination of PIC1, more than 20,000 particles from these four metallic powder samples were measured in time. So this application case demonstrates how the Powder Pro A1 was used to evaluate various parameters, including the angle of repose, angle of spatula, tap density, bulk density, compressibility, and uniformity. This application case demonstrates true density analysis for various powder feedstock and 3D printed parts using the benefit grade zero gas pictometer. It's asking, do you have any advice uh, which medium could be could we use to measure nickel alloy with the, the better sizing? We have, um, we've been using um, our S3 Plus and our 2600. Uh, we've been testing nickel alloy particles and we just use actually use water. And one of the key features of both of these instruments, uh, which are based on laser fraction, is that we have adjustable mechanical stirrers combined with built-in ultrasound. It also has adjustable power levels, so we are able to optimize the suspension of these heavier nickel alloy um, particles while avoiding bubble formation. Um, and this leads us to get uh, reliable results.